my channel is Chai Access and today I'm going to answer the three questions from my supporter in the Facebook page in Chai Access. Um, so sure, I have question, three questions about uh, school ng mga kids niya kasi dadali niya dito sa UK. First, uh, itong tanong niya, once they arrive in UK, they are entitled for the free education already, sabi niya. Yes sir, they are free and then uh, wala kayong ibang gagawin kundi uh, i-register lang yung anak dun sa school. Uh, every area has a catchment area, uh, school catchment areas kung saan kayo nakatira. So, yun. Uh, wala na ibang hahanapin doon. Uh, all you need to do is prepare the birth certificate of the kid, uh, passport copy, and uh, birth uh, receipt or uh, bills payment na may address kayo. Ayun. So, yun lang yung kailangan yung i-prepare sa anak nyo. And then, uh, hindi na kailangan ng Form 137 o kung anong paman, kung anong level or grade na yung anak nyo kasi they are going to base on the age of the kid. Uh, like example sa kid ko nung dumating dito is 6 years old, uh, it's supposed to be grade 1 in the Philippines but here, uh, he's in primary 2. Yes, it's like grade 2 in the uh, in the Philippines. And number 2 question is, sir, is how hard to get a slot in the public school? Yan. So, how hard? No, it's so easy lang, guys. And every catchment area, uh, meron silang 2 to 3 sa kung saan ka nakatira ni school. So, first, uh, meron malapit na Catholic school. Ayan, dyan kami uno nag-inquire. Uh, same day na nag-inquire kami dito sa first uh, school, Catholic school, ay um, puno na siya. So, late daw ko ng one week kasi may Indian na bata na nagparegister last week. Kasi dapat naman kasi mag inquire lang ako. So, hindi ko naman in-expect na pwede palang pumasok na. So, ayun, na ganun lang kadali. Dala-dala ko yung mga doc. So, after that, tatanungin lang kung catchment area ba kung saan yung... Uh, malalaman din nila yung address, tatanungin nila. And then, gusto na lang makasigura, makasigurado bago ka pumunta sa si school o mag-inquire, dapat sinurch mo sa internet or sa uh, merong sa, sa area nyo kung yung school na yon is catchment area nyo ba. Ayun. And then, so, ganun nga, full na yung slot doon sa Catholic school. Uh, nag, the same day, pumunta kami sa second school. Siyempre, malapit lang rin sa amin. So, nag-inquire ako doon at merong slot. So, yun. Ah, uh, after noon, ah, uh, dahil dala ko yung mga documents ng anak ko, ah, uh, at tatlo lang ang hiningi, na-register ko na ang anak ko that day. At pwede mo na siyang papasukin sa araw din na yon kung gusto mo, kahit hindi na kayo uniform. And then the parents, ah, uh, itutor nila, ipapakilala nila sa mga teacher o na magiging, uh, at sa anong room ang magiging anak mo. Sa araw din na yon. But, ah, uh, yun sa akin, Yung anak ko, hindi ko kagad pinapasok kasi that time, ah, uh, gusto kong maka may uniform ang anak ko din. Sa uniform wala, hindi sila ganun kay strict. Kaya lang, meron silang, ang uh, gusto lang nila is black shoes and, uh, white polo shirt or t-shirt. Ah, uh, yun yung uniform nila. And then, jumper. Ah, uh, sa jumper sila nagkakaiba ng kulay sa bawat school. Sa anak ko is red. So, yun. Ganun lang. So, pants black also. Ganun lang yung uniform nila sa primary school. Sa secondary school, ganun din, black and white, and then, uh, black sa anak ko dito sa, sa area namin. The other school, I think, blue, red something sa jumper nila. And, that's it. It's free also in secondary school. High school in the Philippines, equivalent of high school in the Philippines. And then, the three question ni sir is, uh, if ever middle of school year sila dumating, madali pa rin ba pumasok? Yes, sir, napakadaling pumasok sa yung school. Ako, like us, December kami dumating, January mag-inquire lang. Gusto ko lang mag-inquire that day. Pero, syempre, uh, naniguro din ako, dala-dala ko lang yung ko baka tanongin ko anong school or level yung anak ko. Kasi I don't have any idea kung uh, pwede na palang pumasok that time. So, dala-dala ko lang requirements ng anak ko. Kaya na-register ko on the same day, right there and then, na nakapasok. So, ganun. Napaka-easy lang. And then, other details na i-share ko is, uh, they are free o uh, lunch meal. They are free. And then, kung maagang mo papasokin yung anak mo, meron din silang free breakfast. 
uh, they are going to arrive in the school 9. Ang time nila is 9 to 3 p.m. in the afternoon. And today is pandemic, kaya may interval silang every 5 minutes na pumasok every grade. And uh, nursery to grade 3, they are free, entitled to free school uh, or lunch meal. And then grade 4 to grade 7 to primary, ay kailangan nila magbayad. But napakamura lang ng uh, lunch na meal. It's up to you kung picky eater yung anak mo. Uh, kung gusto mong pabaunan, it's fine. And then, yung menu nila, kailangan mong mag-download ng app, school app, na nakaredy na dun this week kung ano yung menu nila. Mamimili ka lang ng four colors. sabi mo sa anak mo, um, kung anong kulay, alam niya yung menu. Blue, red, yellow, and green. Yan lang, I think tatlo lang yang kulay na yan ang pagpipilian. Yung option nila ng menu, iba-iba yan every color, every day. So, every day is four kinds of meal. And then, they are free of snacks there in lunch meal and fruits. Free yun sa kanila. It's up to you kung gusto ng anak mong kumuha. It's free. But except for the milk, meron sila ngayong pandemic, it's free. But before, last year, may bayad siyang 20 pence. Yun. Yun yung mga free na... Uh, Ma, yun ang free sa school ng anak nyo pag nandito na at nag-aral na dito sa UK and what else? yes, sa high school naman, secondary school uh, sa lunch nila may canteen sila, so wala nang free meal <laughs> so meron ganon ilang mo magbaon na but uh, ang high school nila para sila nasa college uh, ikaw ang lilipat uh, lilipat-lipat ng uh, kung anong subject mo yun uh, ibang uh, room, parang college style na siya, but free also walang bayad but you're going to pay high tax <laughs> that's different details guys, but that's guys and that's all guys <laughs> that's all guys, and I hope you learn from me and thank you Sir Joff Joff, uh, for uh, question for your question I hope nasagot ka at natulungan kita thank you so much, at sa lahat ng mga gusto pang magtanong, or mayroon pa kayong other, uh request na gusto nyo malaman or uh, information just comment down below guys on the comment section and that's it uh, thank you for watching guys and I hope you enjoy watching and you learn from this video and God bless everyone please don't forget to click the subscribe button and bell icon guys para notified ka sa mga videos ko and if either if you have any other questions requests just comment down below bye bye and thank you for watching god bless everyone